Back Houston County developers are breathing new life into an old theater. The Muse Theater started showing movies back in the 1950s. This fall, it'll be up and running again. Sarah Hammond takes us inside the building and tells us why the developers say this is something the whole county needs. In March of 1950, moviegoers sat in the red vinyl seats of the Muse Theater for the first time to watch Nancy Goes to Rio. But in the 1970s, the theater closed its doors. It sat empty until 2004 when it became a storage space and an antique mall. <laughs> Now, in 2021, the theater is getting a facelift and a second chance. The city of Perry, I believe, is you know, starving for this type of uh, uh, venue. This fall, owner Chad Bryant says they will open the 4,000 square foot building for concerts, weddings, and even movies. There's a lot of demolition to be done, and then we'll, we'll recreate as much as we can through historical photos, through you know, interviews through whatever, you know, certain features of the property, you know, back to its heyday. They bought the building for $400,000 and are adding another $400,000 in renovations. Co-owner Marty McLeod says they know the city and the whole county are waiting for the doors to open again. We've already had calls, I think, just wanting to want to know when it's going to be available. So, I mean, I think that tells you right there that people are really, they're needing this. Bryant says they're going to stick with the original Art Deco theme of the building, and they even have the old marquee they're getting ready to put back up. The size of it, the historic features of the property, um, is something that you can't duplicate anywhere else in Houston County. Bryant says they've been eyeing the property for a while, and they're up for the challenge of getting it back to its former glory. In Perry, Sarah Hammond, 13 WMAZ News. Brian says the venue can hold 600 people and they are also adding outdoor space for people to enjoy.